Hey everybody, this is Melvin with Tech Running 24 7 and in today's video we want to show you how to set up Samsung Pay on your Galaxy Z Flip 5. So as you can see we have our Galaxy Z Flip 5 here and to set up Samsung Pay you need to go to an app called Samsung Wallet. And so we're going to go to our app switcher here and look through for Samsung Wallet. Now as you can see here it is the app there at the bottom. So we're going to tap on it to open it. Once we open it, uh, it has some little information that you need to look at. Hit continue, then allow. And so now it takes us to where it's asking for our information associated uh, with our Samsung account to set up Samsung Pay. And then it asks you, uh, do you want to use your fingerprint to verify your ID? So I'm going to put my fingerprint in there real quick. And it took the password. Now to the next screen, we're going to hit continue. And allow. And it's asking, do you want to use fingerprint? I'm going to say use fingerprint. And that's to activate Samsung Pay. So scan your fingerprint real quick. And then it's asking to set up a pin. So you need to come up with a four-digit pin. Now, after you set up your PIN, and so now they have your uh, fingerprint and a PIN number, so you can use one or the other. And so now it says add to quick access, so we're going to hit add. And as you see here, it has the different categories where it has payment cards, membership cards, gift cards, coupons, digital keys, health pass, boarding pass, event tickets. <laughs> digital assets and student ID and so today we're going to just deal with um, putting in our payment card that's what most people think of about think about when they think about Samsung pay so we we'll hit a payment card and so it says add payment cards we're gonna hit add payment card there and it says allow Samsung wallet to take pictures and record video and we're going to say uh, while using this app. And now what it wants you to do is to take your credit card and scan it to where to pick it up. And so we're going to be using this credit card today. And we're going to scan, scan the uh, information on the back of it real quick. And so after scanning it and asking for the uh, cardholder's name, We'll put that in there real quick. Then it's asking for the expiration date, which is already in there. Then the security code and zip code, and then hit next. And so after you put your information in, which is your name, your CDC code, your zip code in, it goes to here, this next screen where it says allow Samsung wallet to access devices location. So we're going to hit while using the app only. And then it puts you into the terms of services, and then you scroll all the way down and hit agree. And then it says to verify your card, we're going to do it through text message, email, or call bank. And so we're going to say through the text message. And then we're waiting for code to be sent to us so they send us a code I'm covering it up with my thumb at the moment and then we're gonna hit submit and then as you can see and now as you can see it says card added and so we hit done and it says use Samsung wallet for contactless payments and so it added the card and now all we have to do now it says set and it says replace default payment. We're going to replace whatever we might have had, which we didn't have anything because this is a new device. We'll say replace. So this is our primary card on Samsung Pay. Now, if we were to go back to that menu again, now it shows that we have one payment card there. Of course, membership zero, gift card, coupons, digital keys, all the rest of the items we don't have but we do have our payment card now in Samsung Pay. So if we were to come out of this now, and so now the way we would use Samsung Pay, if we were at the register, 
we wanted to purchase something, we just swipe up from the bottom like so, and our card would pop up, and then we would hit our fingerprint or hit the pin. I prefer the fingerprint, so I hit the fingerprint there, and it shows you that you would just put this over the uh, credit card machine to scan it, and it would pick up your information. And so that's one way of using Samsung Pay after you get it installed. Another way, too, with the flip, you can uh, go to your outside screen like so. So to open in the phone, you can swipe up like this, and the card would come up again. So that's pretty cool. But I have to open it up and then hit your fingerprint again. And then, as you can see, it's counting down as you take it over and scan at the register. So that's it for our video for today, how to set up Samsung Pay on your Galaxy Flip 5. So hopefully we shared something that you can use and something that was beneficial. If so, be sure to hit that subscribe button down below and hit the like button. And don't forget to hit the uh, bell icon too to be notified of new content as soon as we release it. And again, this is Melvin with Tech Renner 24-7, bringing you technology that's on the move. Thanks.